Use Facebook's ad retargeting system to pull Instagram users deeper into your funnel. This is my secret weapon when it comes to Instagram. Make no mistake, if you followed all the steps above and you used a multi-page strategy to build up your mailing list, you will achieve some level of success. However, if you want to turbocharge your results, you need to deploy Facebook's ad retargeting system. How does ad retargeting work? When you retarget ads using Facebook, you first install Facebook's pixel on your website. You then go about promoting on Facebook and Instagram. And when people find themselves on your site after clicking on a profile link, the pixel keeps track of where they landed. Now that the system knows which Instagram or Facebook users ended up on your site, you can take out a retargeting ad. This ad can promote a deeper page or it can promote your mailing list directly. Whatever the case may be, when people who have visited your site go back to Facebook or Instagram, they start seeing your ads. This is like shooting fish in a barrel. You're essentially reminding them to come back. When they click, they can go to a deeper page so you can build more credibility, or you can even direct them to buy a product. That's right, they go to a sales page. Regardless of how you do it, retargeting works. In fact, according to some estimates, it can boost conversions by 40%. The bottom line is that you use content to draw truly interested people. They wouldn't be clicking the content if they were not interested. But you have to set up your retargeting in such a way that only people who go past the initial page of your website are retargeted. For example, you run a free Instagram marketing campaign. You post reverse engineered content on your account to build up a following. Enough people like your content so they click on your profile page and they see a link to a really useful article. They click through and they end up on an article and Facebook Pixel is paying attention to them. However, you're not going to be retargeting those people. That's still too shallow. When they click through because they liked your particular solution and they want to know more about that solution, they end up on a solutions page. This may be a sales page, or this can also be another consumer guide page. Whatever the case may be, they have gotten deeper into the guts of your website. These are the people you should retarget because these are the people who have demonstrated real interest. People who are just curiosity seekers would just end up on a shallow page. They would begin there and they would end there. People who are really looking for a solution would click page after page on your website. Those are the people who are more likely to convert. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.